Sparkle is helping to make these dark days just a little bit brighter. It started off as an idea to deliver jewelry to women working on the front lines in hospitals. Now it's a movement that's spread all across the country called Project Sparkle. Christine Lammers puts together these goodie bags of jewelry all day. Then she says she goes to bed at night thinking about who she can help next. This is what we know and this is what we love. The Canton mom who works for Park Lane Jewelry was talking to friends in Texas a few weeks ago. They came up with the idea to gift women working in hospitals with earrings and bracelets. The project definitely started with healthcare workers, but since then it has snowballed into the women who are volunteering and handing out meals at the local school districts, the grocery store clerks, your postal carriers. Every $15 donation buys one gift set. Volunteers then match each gift with another one of their own. We also know that jewelry does make people feel happier. Hundreds already given out all across Metro Detroit, thousands more around the country from Texas to Washington, Florida, Illinois and New York. It's a huge movement of pay it forward, like figure out what you can do to make a difference and make people feel a little bit better right now and go do that. Attached to each gift is a note written by local girls and boys thanking them for their service. I, mean, I think the gift is great, but it really is the handwritten thank you note that's coming from the community. Um, and it is those handwritten note cards that really mean the difference to all these people are stuck inside. We are sheltering in place. So we feel like we're doing one tiny part, but there's so many other things that you could be doing. And if you'd like to help get involved with Project Sparkle, we've posted all the details you need to know on our website. Click on Detroit.com. I'm Sandra Ali. Back to you. That is awesome, Sandra. Thank you. And we are constantly looking for acts of kindness like this all over town. So if you see one, we want to know about it. Just go to click on Detroit.com slash kindness and send us a message.